Hi, this is Richard Byrne at freetech4teachers.com. In this video, we're going to take a look at how you can create an interactive video by using video.co. I have it launched here in my desktop. I'm going to go ahead and sign into my account. Let's start with a blank template. You can pick from any of the templates that you want to use, but the blank one is the simplest one to get started with. So here we can see we have kind of a layout of scenes and you can just keep adding slides as you go. And over here we have images, objects, background, sound, text, and an interactive button. So I'm going to go to the images first. And I've previously uploaded an image here. I'm going to apply that to the slide. Now if I want to change the background, I can pick from any of these. I can put that in the background. Or this is my background now. As you can see, I can quickly click and change between backgrounds. Now to make this interactive, I'm going to select the Interact button. I'm going to apply a button. And I'll move that button down just by clicking and dragging. Now to edit the text, I'll just click Edit. And I'm going to say Learn More. Now I'll put in a destination URL. And as you can see, we can change the button color if we want to. We can make it purple. We can change the text color to something else if I want to make it that. And I've also selected to pause the video and to open the URL in a new window. So if someone's viewing this video online, he or she can click the button, go out to whatever website I've linked to, the video will pause, and they can come back and resume the video at any time. Now down here at the bottom, we can specify how long we want each slide in our video to play for. So I'm going to scroll that one back to about 45 seconds or so. Now let's go ahead and preview it. And so we preview the scene. Now there's not a whole lot happening. We just have one scene in this slide. Let's go ahead and add another slide. We'll add another blank. Again, we can add another image. Or we can add objects. So I want to use an icon. I can put that icon in place. And I'll repeat the process until I have all the scenes that I want to use arranged in my video. Let's go ahead and preview the video. And as you can see, my Learn More button is now active. And I'm happy with that. So let's go ahead and save the video. And click the share button. Give this a title. We'll just call this one training. And save it. And now we have the embed code. We can link to it. We can upload it directly to YouTube. We can send it out on social media as well. So that's how you can create an interactive video by using video.co. And for more tips and tricks like this, please check out freetech4teachers.com.